to, let's say you wanted to add a title slide to this. You forgot to add a title slide. I see you have a call out on track three. You have audio on track two, your screen recording on one. Can you move everything over and keep it in sync uh, and add a title slide of some sort? Yeah, yeah, you can. Actually, this is something that happens to me uh, all the time. I, I forget to do uh, a title slide of some sort. So the way to do that is to take your playhead, drag it all the way back to the beginning, because we already created this intro, right? It's just going to start by fading in. But if we want a title slide there, put the playhead all the way at the beginning, hold the shift key down on your keyboard, and click and drag that playhead to the right as for as much space as you need. And as you mentioned, Ryan, we have all these things on multiple tracks, but by using that click and drag, by holding the shift key and clicking the playhead, everything stays in sync. And now we have all this space here to add a title slide. And it's easy to go back into maybe my library, go into some of those pre-built intros, like, uh, I don't know, my favorite, the minimal elegance title and drag that down here onto my play timeline. And I now, whoops, I had it and I dropped it. So it's here. Uh, now I have a title that can be customized over my properties panel. And then to close the gap that I just created, I double click on the media that I moved over and I do the same thing in reverse. Hold the shift key, click and drag the playhead back to the left until they match up. And now all of a sudden I have an intro slide and I go right into my recording. 